Do you know that the body cannot heal properly in an acidic environment? Let me give you an example. Sometimes I get inflammation in my shoulder or my back. I usually tend to get it in my left shoulder or sometimes in my knees. I don't know about you, but I've noticed that I usually get more inflammation when I eat acidy foods. So if I get the knee pain or shoulder pain, and I start eating a whole bunch of food that is just acidy. I find that the, the pain comes back more. It comes back stronger, comes back harder, or the pain just doesn't go away at all. It isn't until I eat foods that are less acidic, that's when I notice my pain start to go away. Foods that are less acidic, like fruits and vegetables. So what you wanna do is look at a pH chart, pH food chart, because what a lot of people don't realize is that the food you eat can affect your body. So if you're eating foods that cause inflammation, how can you relieve yourself of inflammation without it taking a, a forever, without it taking a long time? It shouldn't take that long for your body to remove inflammation because the human body is able to heal itself if it's under the right conditions, if it has the right environment. If you're giving it the right food, it will heal itself. If you don't, then the issue will just stay there. Alcohol, coffee soda processed foods like say like mcdonald's or something all that stuff is acidic foods that are not acidic or more on the alkaline side is going to be fruits vegetables grapes blueberries uh, watermelon cucumber uh, asparagus is going to be more alkaline and that's going to be able to help you relieve your inflammation if you look at plants or foods that help with relieving inflammation you notice that they're that it's plants. One, the first thing is that they're plants. Like if you look at a pill, there's pills that remove inflammation and they'll be made of turmeric. What is turmeric? Turmeric is like, is like a root. A root is a what? It's a plant. So what we need is plants to heal ourselves. Not only do plants carry certain minerals that help with the body relieve its ailments, also they're higher in the pH scale. Higher in the pH scale means it's gonna help your body stay in equilibrium. The human body needs to stay at seven pH, a pH level of seven. Seven is neutral. If you're always eating acidic foods and no fresh fruits or vegetables, nothing healthy like that, and you have pain, don't be surprised if it takes forever to go away. Some people have like a knee or shoulder pain that has been constant. Me, it flares up when I eat certain foods I know I probably shouldn't be eating, you know? But hey, we're all human, we all make this, we all don't do everything perfectly, you know? But knowledge is power. So the way that knowledge is power for me, whenever I get that pain, I know how to relieve it. I know how to make it worse. So whenever my pain comes, eat fruits and vegetables. I take my spirulina, that helps out big time. I take my spirulina, that pain is gone. After the next day, two, no more than two days, boom no more pain and it's usually from eating meals from like pizza or like thanksgiving dinner those kind of foods give me inflammation just because they're acidic the acidity is what's causing the inflammation and the pain but the alkalinity and the minerals in those fruits and vegetables is what's going to help neutralize it because it's going to put your body bring it back closer to a neutral pH level which what your body needs you know studies show that a lot of these of these disorders and ailments and problems that people have a lot of it comes from overindulgence of acidity in our body we as a culture have accepted coffee as a staple as like a morning routine but what is coffee coffee is like predominantly acid it's like soda it's like drinking a coca-cola in the morning things like coffee soda is best in moderation you're not supposed to be consuming that all day so let me ask you this question if you have pain in your shoulder, your back, knees, whatever. Think about what you've been eating the past couple weeks. What do you eat mostly during the day? Do you eat a lot of candy during the day? Do you drink a lot of soda? Do you drink water at all? Some people don't drink water. Do you eat fruit or vegetables at all? So many people out there don't eat any fruits or vegetables, but yet they wonder why they got this pain. Because for some weird reason, today's culture likes to relieve the symptoms instead of the main problem. The symptoms are back pain, knee pain, inflammation, heart disease, and all this stuff. So we're quick to put a Band-Aid on something like give you pain relief for your knee pain, but not removing the main thing that actually caused the knee pain in the first place. You'll take a Tylenol to relieve the pain and then wash it all down with a Coca-Cola, fried chicken and macaroni and cheese and wonder why your pain won't go away. You're not doing anything to help it. 
if you think of the body as like a machine, just like a car, it needs a certain type of oil, it needs a certain octane of gasoline, maintenance check after a certain interval, a certain amount of miles, and if you don't do those things, then you're gonna have problems transmission engine issues and then if you're someone who insists on doing the repairs with the wrong supplies your issue is not going to get resolved it's just going to transform into something else and transform into something else so instead of us continuing to just only heal our symptoms let's focus on actually fixing the main cause of our issues I really like those green drinks that they make now where you can get it in a powder form and it's basically got so many fruits and vegetables it can take the place of a lot of the fruit and vegetables that you're not eating because the common man today is very busy and usually doesn't have time to eat a whole giant bowl of fruits and vegetables that we need most people go for convenience that's why a lot of people do the fast food and stuff so here's a convenient method take these one of these green drinks it's a pre-made mix that has damn near everything you need for all the fruits and vegetables that you're missing out on. A lot of them have things like pineapple, a lot of your greens, spinach, kale, turmeric, chlorella, spirulina in them. And all these things have vitamins and minerals that are going to help your body to stay healed, help your body heal itself. It makes it easier for us in this current busy day that we live in now. Remember that old saying that everybody says, knowledge is power. It's true. Because the moment you know something, now you can actually do something about it. Instead of just being a victim of your circumstances, you can do something about your circumstances. So if you don't have time to actually eat all those fruits and vegetables, something I can help you is supplementing. Don't supplement artificial. Don't supplement a Band-Aid. Don't take something that's just going to relieve the pain. Take something that's going to actually fix the problem. Take care of yourselves. Peace.